Right. Once you've acquired your head tracker, uh, you've plugged it in, you've done the initial setup and the calibration of it, you then stick it to your headset. Once you are there, you come to this point where you're in game and you have to make it work. So, go to options, controls. You want to come all the way down to where is it? Look, there it is. Right, that is the slider on the joystick. Slider up, slider down. That means that whichever way I slide it, it will either activate head look or switch it off. Um, that makes it simple. Mouse head look must be switched off, otherwise it interferes. Head look access mode is direct. Sensitivity, ignore it because it doesn't work unless you've set accumulate. You only want to set the look up and down axis and the look left and right axis. So look up and down, nod your head, look left and right, turn your head left and right. These are the dead zones. I said dead zones because it gets a bit twitchy in the middle if it's down to zero. So the dead zone allows you to have a little bit of leeway in the middle. Um, once you've done that, apply it. Go back into the game and operate the slider. And there we go. As you can see, look up, look down, look right, look left. If you find that you're looking right and it's going left, or you're looking up and it's going down, you can go back in to the options Uh, I've only had to do this once or twice and I've no idea why it's up, it changed but you can invert the access so that's, you invert the access so that up and down will obviously invert that makes it work so that is basically that